So here is my Aldi's haul. And again, this is not what we normally um, you know, spend as much money. But um, I wanted to kind of show you today because I haven't been grocery shopping in a couple of weeks. So the total we spent today was $228.34. Um, just so you guys know, we you know we bought quite a bit of things. But to start off, I just want to show you really quickly. Um, we did get a box of Kleenex, a 24-pack of Pampers diapers, and a case of water, which you won't see on the film. And also we have... Um, Three gallons of milk, but I had to put them away so they didn't because we've been out for a while. So, 228, and this is everything that we got. And I'll go over and kind of show you real quickly. So, we got four things of the orange juice. Three of them are um, not from Concentrate, and one of them is from Concentrate because Solar goes through orange juice like crazy. So, that's the Concentrate. I bought some pinto beans to make red beans and rice, some sour cream for either enchiladas or to make my homemade dips again, 100% um, whole wheat bread. We've got some cheddar cheese. Um, Mike likes their deodorant. Um, they sell Old Spice there. It's really inexpensive. Um, some pastry crisps, which are good for breakfast. We had to bust it open because Christian was in the store and was hungry. Mike wanted this French vanilla um, creamer. I just like straight up milk, but he likes that stuff, so we'll let him drink that. Um, we got two things of their turkey sausage. These things are amazing. The kids love them. They're better than the regular ones. They're half the fat. and They have a pretty decent flavor. Um, and they're for quick to give them when we're running in the morning for school. I bought some chicken drumsticks. They were $1.19 a pound. We can do baked chicken, um, Chinese, like a teriyaki chicken. Um, we can do soups and stews with the chicken. I bought some chicken wings because I've been craving some chicken wings. So I'm going to um, roast those and make like a, um, what is it, oh my goodness, a buffalo sauce. We got some chicken thighs. Um, you can buy boneless, skinless, but I just like them with the, yeah, it's more flavor. And I usually roast these with some sage or some seasonings. We brought some cereal bars, some um, apple cinnamon cereal bars, some pita chips for me, some tortillas. So I can make them some homemade tacos or enchiladas. I bought two things of bacon. I've been really craving bacon lately. So I bought two things of bacon, um, breakfast, or to make some salads and make my own crumbled bacon instead of the artificial bacon bits. Um, I bought some French toast bites. We usually we do the fresh toast sticks, but they have bites, which will be perfect for the kids. Um, I bought two boxes of their multiple fruit squeezable blends. These are just easy for Christian to have as a side for his um, fruit in the morning. Um, I bought a pack of pork chops, which I'm going to bread them and bake them. Um, a thing of 90-10 ground beef, which beef is so versatile. You can make um, stuffed peppers. You can make um, enchiladas. I make chili. I make hamburger soup. Um, these I was really excited about. They are called, let's see, Kumado tomatoes. Product of Mexico, simply unique brown tomato. I thought they were kind of neat. They've got like a reddish brown hue to them. I figured I'm going to try to make fried green tomatoes with these because they're kind of more firm. So we'll see how that works out. Um, I bought a bag of carrots, a bigger bag, and this was only 49 cents. 49 or 59. I'm pretty sure 49. Um, we got a couple of Greek yogurts for Mike and then a regular raspberry yogurt. Um, two sticks of butter, one salted unsalted for baking, some mushrooms to saute with some eggs for an omelet, um, or I'm going to make a beef stew. I bought their 100% pure maple syrup because um, I want to make a glazed, actually with the chicken thighs, I want to try to make a, a glaze for them and bake them. I bought a thing of green grapes, and those were 4 bucks. Some fruit snacks, all natural, from their Simply Natural Kids line. No artificial fla um, flavorings or colors, and they're made with real juice. Um, I bought two things of these crescent rolls that we make apple dumplings with, and we just have them for dinner on the side when I don't make homemade bread. Two things of cinnamon rolls, because Cinnabons is expensive, and for some reason I like them. Um, I already showed you the pita chips. Um, I bought some Fiber Now bars for Mike. Um... The kids, once in a while, I'll let them eat one, but you know how those goes with fiber. goes right through them. Um, some mini brownies, two boxes for just treats for the kids' lunches. Um, here's Christian. I don't know if you can see him, despite the mess. Sorry. 
Um, and then I bought a thing of pudding for the kids' lunches for school, some smoothies, Danimals, no artificial flavorings or colors with this one. So I got two of these, and I also got um, two of these Joe plates. I had showed you one, I think, on the other side. I bought a package of turkey franks to cut up and wrap with the crescent rolls, a thing of grape tomatoes just to eat. Or what I do is I take these and I put a little olive oil, garlic, balsamic vinegar, and let them saute. And they are so caramelized and great. A thing of green beans, which I usually put a little olive oil and garlic and saute them with salt and pepper. Um, some more cream cheese. I decided, I was looking at the labels for the strawberry cream cheese. And there's just high fructose corn syrup and other things. So I'm going to take this and take some strawberries and dice them up. Or I'll take the strawberries and kind of make my own little jam with them and mix in with this for the kids for their bagels. Um, some stewed tomatoes or diced tomatoes. A thing of cottage cheese. I saw this recipe on the Pioneer Woman where she made a cheesy not cheesy uh, noodle bake with cottage cheese. It looked great. A thing of green onions for this um, chicken um, Chinese chicken dish I make called Sichuan Chicken. Um, that size one is called Sichin. Um, some spinach. Um, they actually had two bags of greens, so I am going to make some greens and neck bones, some good old southern food. So mustard and turnips they had. And these were on sale for $1.99. I bought a thing of potatoes. Two Lunchables for the kids just for Friday for a treat. Um, red potatoes were like $1.49 for that big bag. I bought um, some corn you see there. Diced tomatoes. I have some crushed tomatoes for spaghetti sauce or for stews. Oh, it's just so amazing. Some corn, I said. And I'm going to take you right back around to show you some of the other things that I got. Um, this Chihuahua cheese was on sale for $8.99. Oh, my gosh. It is amazing on just tacos. It's amazing on enchiladas. The kids eat it by itself. Mix it with some eggs. And it's usually at our uh, Mexican supermarket, like 12 bucks for this bag. So that's a good deal. And then we bought some pancakes to go. I don't know if I showed those, but if I did, I'm sorry. Then their Dixie cups were on sale for like $2, their version. Good for the kids to kind of rinse their mouths and gargle with. And I don't think I missed anything else. Now, this is kind of a snapshot of everything. Remember, we're a family of six. So two twenty eight I spent. Usually I do about one twenty a week on groceries. So this was a little bit, you know, more because I didn't shop the previous weeks. So um, I hope that you guys enjoy the video. Um, please let me know if you have any questions, comments. Um, but I love shopping. I love grocery shopping. I love doing those type of things. So um, I'll have another haul up for you guys in a couple days, hopefully from Trader Joe's, of what I'm going to be getting there. Um, to finish off for this. So, again, thanks for watching. And if you've subscribed, thank you so much. And hopefully I can get some more videos kind of going on with the new year. But I'm trying to work on that. It's a lot of work. So, um, take care and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.